Welcome guys to a series that I am bringing back to life. I am revitalizing this series. It is called Road to World Cup and basically um, when FIFA 13 first came out back in September, October time, I can't really remember. It's been uh, quite a while since then but um, I was going to do a series where I took an international team to the World Cup finals and actually win the final of the World Cup to win the trophy. Um, but I somehow dropped the ball on that whole series but I'm bringing it back to life and the best international offer we got was actually Germany so we're gonna take it and we're gonna show I'm gonna show you the first game I was in charge and it was against Romania away and um, just to let you show you that the difficulty is on world class uh, so it's gonna be sort of a challenge especially away from home against Romania who are actually a very very tough team um, they're very solid I'd say they've got they're not they haven't got the most exceptional players in the world but they're very good as a squad so Something to watch out for. So let's get into it. Romania versus Germany. This is to see how well I can do in the in control of Germany, in the reins of the German uh, national squad. How what can I get from this team? This is basically a tester, and um, a tester it was because straight away Romania showing what they're about, sh causing all sorts of troubles for Germany. All kinds of trouble. You know, this was getting very, very tense game for me. I mean, I wasn't expecting it, to be honest. I thought Germany were going to walk over them, but hell to the no. This is our only chance of the first half here. Schürrle intercepts a uh, pass or tackles him. Can't remember what it was, but as you can see, not many options in the box. He sort of goes to the touchline and pulls it back. And unlucky Schweinsteiger with that volley, causing a sort of a problem here. But first, first half's gone, nil-nil. So we had to make a change. Royce comes on. To offer some more dynamic approach to the game, get, give us a bit more pace, and that pace sort of revitalised our team because in the 48th minute, Schürrle finds Podolski here, and beautiful header from Podolski. He's not really known for his headers, but puts it into the back of the net in the 48th minute. Lucas Podolski, get in there, my son. Hopefully, this we can hold on to this lead, but it was short-lived because Romania uh, wants us to show what they're about, especially in front of home, and they score in the 56th minute to cause us even more trouble. 1-0 is not where I want to be in my first game in charge. And again, they cause the trouble. Kadira intercepts it but passes it straight back to the Romanian player and he scores in the 74th minute. Kadira really had to uh, redeem himself, really show what he's about and he does with a near post finish here. In the 81st minute, I was sweating it out at this moment in the game. I was panicking. I really, really, really didn't want to lose my first game. And Podolski here one two nicely and he breaks through the line of defense and I'm hoping he scores I want to win my first game in charge for Germany show the German fans what I'm about what I can bring to the table as the manager of Germany and hopefully we can get somewhere in the World Cup so in the 90th minute Lukas Podolski seals the deal and we win 3-2 yes 3-2 whoop a doo uh, yeah it was a friendly, I understand. It wasn't very competitive. But this was really a, a tester for me. Really see how the team plays. What I have to change around like in a manager's perspective. What players come in, what players come out. What the best formation is for the team. So, hopefully, we can carry on this nice little goal scoring run I'm on. Three goals in the first game It's not bad. But we got to get rid of those two goals we conceded in the first game game because it's not very good to be honest especially Germany are supposed to be efficient they're supposed to be well drilled they're not supposed to let goals in and we let goals in so it's a bit of a shocker but that's it from me guys hope you enjoyed this video stick around for the World Cup because it's going to be interesting I'm out peace